Well, a very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful. Perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well. No doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. We have terrific scenes in front of us at the Estadio Dodrigal, one of the biggest venues in Portugal. The lineup we have suggests it's going to be a 4 5 1 formation, Jim. Well, if you want to secure a clean sheet, Peter, this is a very good way of going about it. It adds discipline and lends a stubbornness to that midfield, which can stifle opposition attempts to, to play through. And it takes a lot of pressure off your defence, of course. Forces longer passes through the aerial route. So, all things considered, that extra layer across midfield is highly, highly effective. So, off we go then. To the keeper and go again. Stepanenko. Drives it towards the front. Alaba. Marcelo. Vinicius Junior. Tony Kroos. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Casemiro gets his foot in there. Marcelo. Valverde. And it's Benzema. Time to deliver. Who's he going to play in? Tries to get it forward quickly. Alaba tries to clear. That has put a stop to that. And here's Benzema, it's got through Kroos! That has certainly tested the keeper. Tony Kroos sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. Kroos with the short one, Marcelo. Vinicius Junior. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? There are a few waiting for it. Tony Kroos. Can he deliver? In comes the massive lead. Just couldn't turn it in. I have to commend the wing play, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Look, he's offering an apology to his teammate, who's clearly miffed at not being picked out despite... Makes shapes to shoot! Goal! Real Madrid! What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. 
lobs it in gentle. Great leap! He will be livid with himself. Oh, I'm not sure what he had in mind, and I don't think he knew either. Gets it back. Nacho. Real Madrid are enjoying a good spell right now and leading. Chance! Oh! And it's Benzema. Tony Kroos, Kroos with the cross. That had too much on it. Stepanenko hoists it forward. Vinicius Junior breaks on here. Goes long. Well, it seems as if he's just had a momentary lapse and, and slipped into tunnel vision because he had good options around him and he failed to get his head up. Casemiro sticks in a foot to win it back. Tony Kroos. Casemiro, hardly anything between the sides, and the score is 1-0. Valverde, Casemiro, Nacho, pumps it into towering header! Oh, just needed a better contact. Well, the the whistle for half time. So there you have it, a close spirit half of football. But it still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A really decent game up to now. Here we go again then. Real Madrid going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit. But they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Vinicius Junior. Marcelo goes for the cross. Finds himself eased off the ball. Benzema is now the subject of some adhesive marking. Yeah, his instinct and the timing of his runs have proven fruitful, but they have to give him a harder time like that. Plays it out to the flank. Come back to the keeper. minutes played. So Jim, what are you thinking? Well, Peter, if they're attempting to see out the game with such a, a narrow advantage, there's room for trouble. Uh, I just think they're sending out the wrong... It's Benzema! A real chance and a real let-off. Benzema looked very impressive there. Well, at least until he got into a shooting position, something I'm sure he'd want to have a go at again.
Ronaldo to say he was expecting a better ball than that. Vinicius Junior is looking up for options on the left. Vinicius Junior. He's got options in the box if he gets his head. He's had a shot! Oh, effort. He reacted well. Shakhtar Donetsk can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Brushed off the ball there. Alaba. And it's played forward. Marcelo. Vinicius Junior. Here it comes. Oh, he'd have done well to reach that. Played out to the right. And it's Benzema. Casemiro. Nacho. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Forward it goes. Alaba. Tony Kroos. Vinicius Junior. And here's Benzema. Vinicius Junior. Real Madrid are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. Casemiro with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. situation and it needs to be any time now really great strength too strong for his opponent and again they run up against stubborn defending Casemiro and that will be the final act what a game End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Well, to me, this is a result, Peter, that says an awful...